Welcome to this third session on MicroFocus's DevWeb protocol. In this video, we will cover the script generation process via the proxy recorder. We'll record a simple business flow using the proxy recorder and export it to an HAR file. We'll start by downloading the proxy recorder from the MicroFocus application delivery marketplace. There are three flavors of proxy recorder. Windows, Linux Ubuntu, and Mac OS. The proxy recorder is cross-platform, so you can download the flavor that is appropriate for your operating system. However, for this video, we'll be demonstrating using Windows. Refer to the documentation appropriate for your operating system for more information. To use the proxy recorder, we install it by extracting the zip file to a directory on the machine. First, we set the certificates that will be used for HTTPS recording. Note that this step is not required if you just want to record HTTP. The different certificates are located in the CERT folder. We provide several default certificates which can be used if no private certificate is available. You can use your own certificates by registering the path to the certificate in the custom CA certificate variable in the config YAML file. We will register the default DevWeb certificates that we provided in the CERT folder via the Windows Certificate Registration Wizard. Right-click the certificate and select the Install option. Follow the wizard steps until the certificate is installed. We continue by setting the proxy recorder as the proxy that the machine will use for its outbound communication. The settings must match the host and port defined in the config YAML file located in the installation directory. The default host is localhost and default port is 8156. One way to set the proxy is via the proxy settings configuration screen of Windows. Other operating systems have a similar way to define the system-wide proxy. You can also define the proxy directly from the browser if a browser is used. If we need the corporate proxy to access the application under test, we will need to set the corporate proxy inside the proxy settings. We do so by uncommenting the whole section and writing the correct host and port. If needed, we can also add the user and password to be passed. We are now ready to record the business process. It is recommended to use the private browsing mode of the browser, or incognito mode in Chrome, or to disable the cache in regular mode. After the message proxy server listening appears, we can start the flow in the browser. Open Chrome in incognito mode. Once finished, we press enter once in the command and wait for the process to finish. The resulting HAR file can now be converted to a DevWeb script using the offline generator. Please review the previous video to learn how to do that. Once you are satisfied with the HAR file, revert the proxy settings of the machine to their original state. Thank you for watching this video about generating an HAR file using the proxy recorder. We invite you to watch our next video, Basic Scripting with DevWeb. Thank <music> you.